you know. <laughs> so I'll do what I can when I can. Uh, I am going to take the outside wheel lift off. There's the thunder. On both sides, I really don't need it for what's here. Uh, if I had to fertilize tanks and all that on it, yeah, I would probably need it. But I don't need it, so I'm going to take them off and replumb it to oh, stay the way it is. <laughs> But that's what I've been doing today. Uh, maybe having to slack off a little bit on the videos because I've got me back hurting. And uh, this one's different. I may be down for a count for a few days. I don't know. We'll find out, I guess. But at any rate, guys, uh, I'm getting out of here before it rains. Uh, got to get everything put up, so I'm calling it a day. So we'll see you next time, guys. And as always, please comment, rate, and subscribe. I'm going to put couplers out here so I can take the hoses off because ain't no sense leaving hoses lay outside to get nasty, especially when they're Chinese. <laughs> so we'll see you next time, guys. Well, hi, guys. It's, uh... Wednesday, I think. Uh, been working on the planter today. Finishing working on the planter, I should say. And <laughs> after last year's fiasco of the mechanical lift being stretching a chain and just being a god awful mess. Uh, I decided to put all the hydraulics back on this and I did but there's a problem um, bought brand new two by eight cylinders for put on the markers uh, the smallest piston I could get two inch and it's a one inch two inch bore one inch piston I thought, well, that should work. And I had kind of a bad feeling about this. Um, knowing how Oliver's hydraulics are, and I was afraid of this happening. It will pick up and let down no problem. The problem is that it's closed center hydraulics. Uh, you guys that know all run Oliver's, you know what I'm talking about. They're you can't takes pressure to keep the valve open, and when the pressure bleeds off, that's it. You might say, and this won't let the markers drop. Um, it just doesn't have enough time to let the fluid out before the valve on the tractor closes because the pump deadheads. So, after <laughs> taking, you can see it there, the wheel assembly off, replumbed everything, uh, put all the hydraulic marker stuff back on. <laughs> It was basically for nothing. Uh, if I had the if the long was running, this would work just slick as a whistle. But it won't work on the Oliver the way the hydraulics on are on the tractor. Um, I thought about disconnecting the this hose here which is the pressure down and doing the one-way valve one-way hydraulic thing on this tractor to use a one-way cylinder and that would have let maybe let the markers drop 
but when you go to a one-way cylinder on the 50 series Oliver the uh, a you lock the the three-point hitch gets locked out and if the system bleeds through internally you'll have to keep bumping the hydraulic lever down in order to keep it down um, this being it has the loader on it is you know plumb two-way so that's not going to be a very good option for this tractor uh, I thought about getting dad's 1550 gas out and doing that but and I talked to McHenry's the local Oliver dealership they said if you're going to be using a lot like this for a planter it may or may not continue to work it may damage the hydraulic system I don't want to do that so I guess what I'm going to have to do like it or not now is <laughs> either do like I did last year and plant by eyeball or put a board across the front of the tractor with a chain hanging down for you know to drag the previous row I don't like doing that but I may have to <sighs> always got to be something uh, always got to be something oh well uh, one way or another, I'm going to be planting tomorrow, so <laughs> it's, uh, it ought to get interesting pretty quick. Uh, nothing I can do but do it. So, me and Pop is going to call it a day. Uh, not really <laughs> much I can do with it right at the moment. Uh, I hadn't gotten done and got my beans yet, and they closed at four o'clock. So it's now about six. So oh well, I won't be planting tonight. Didn't really intend on it, but it is what it is. When you got other things you got to do in a day's time. At any rate, guys, I'm going to get off here. Uh, planter work. Like I say, getting all the the hydraulic switched over the other set of wheels taken off and cylinders taken off and replumbed and the new marker cylinders put on and all this happy stuff uh, was for nothing. <laughs> Go figure, right? At any rate, guys, I'm going to get off here. Uh, I'm getting hungry. It's been a long day and I haven't had lunch yet. So, <laughs> time to go to the house. So we'll see you next time, guys. And as always, please comment, rate, and subscribe. We'll see you next time, guys.